Hello friends, welcome to your channel, Murano Channel. In this channel, we explore the beautiful creatures of nature and learn more about their behavior. Well, in today's program, we travel to the depths of the oceans, the habitat of dolphins, until the end of the video. Stay together and subscribe to our channel and let your friends know. Thank you. What is a dolphin? Dolphins belong to the Delphinidae family, which also includes orcas and pilot whales. All of them are cetacean mammals. Smaller cetaceans with long noses are usually called dolphins, larger species are called whales. Food habits of dolphins herding is a common style in which dolphins hunt for food. This style includes a protective shell-shaped collective work so that the group of swirling fish in the center is surrounded by dolphins. Then it is the turn of each dolphin to quickly swallow as many fish as it can while the other dolphins stand guard. Some species use their tails to knock their prey unconscious and consume it until it disfigures. Food is considered an important driving factor for dolphins to move and travel long distances. They migrate to an area where the water temperature is suitable and food is available. There are times when dolphins mistake plastic waste or other human waste for food. These are extremely dangerous to dolphins, and they usually die after choking on them. Dolphin Habitat Dolphins are found in all the world's open waters and oceans. Most of them live in warm waters, but many groups of killer whales live in the cold and polar waters of the Arctic and Antarctic. Species of river dolphins are also found in several rivers in the world, including the Amazon and the Indus. They are found on Earth in almost every type of marine habitat, from shallow banks to deep ledge areas in the oceans. The way of life and social behavior of dolphins, dolphins are social and live in groups with diverse populations. River dolphins are found in small groups of 2 to 10, dolphins that live near the shores form groups with 50 members, and the population of groups of ocean dolphins that live far from the shores sometimes reaches hundreds or thousands of dolphins. Although membership in groups is not exclusive and they can join a group from other groups, dolphins have a strong sense of social solidarity and stay with other members of the group who are injured or sick and even bring them to the surface of the water to breathe. This altruism is not exclusive to their own race and they help other marine animals as well. Also, some dolphins have kept them safe from shark attacks by circling around swimmers or attacked sharks to keep them away from the swimming area of humans. What is the threat to the life of dolphins? The biggest threat to dolphins is human activity because they have very few enemies in their natural habitat. The Amazon, Ganges, and Yangtze River dolphins are critically endangered species due to human intervention. The sleep pattern of dolphins, the pattern of sleeping and waking up in dolphins is very different from humans and most other mammals that live on land, and such a pattern requires more processing by their brains. In general, dolphins have a quiet, low-activity brain hemisphere when they sleep, which gives them enough alertness to breathe and watch out for attackers and other potential dangers. At this time, half of the brain rests and the other half remains awake. The signs of the initial stages of sleep can appear simultaneously in both cerebral hemispheres. Because a dolphin that falls asleep completely drowns, these animals, unlike humans, have complete control over their every breath. The use of dolphins, dolphins have been used by humans for a wide range of purposes since the past. Helping humans and hunting fish has been one of the oldest examples of cooperation between humans and dolphins. However, they are sometimes killed by humans so that their meat can be used for food. 
Dolphin meat has its fans in Japan and Peru. In Japan, dolphin meat is sold as whale meat. This meat is cooked with miso, carrot, and kuniako, and its steak with soy sauce also has its fans. Since dolphins are at the top of the food pyramid, the level of mercury in their bodies is very high, and eating their meat by humans can transfer that level of mercury to humans. Scientists believe that dolphin meat can be dangerous if consumed by pregnant mothers. Taking help from dolphins in psychotherapy and helping physically challenged patients has also seen significant growth in the past years. A 2005 study shows that dolphins are good assistants for doctors in the treatment of mild to advanced depression. However, the results of this survey were criticized in several ways, among them, it was not determined whether dolphins are more successful in helping the mentally ill than domestic animals such as dogs and cats. Further investigations by other scientists in this regard showed that important methodological errors had occurred in the aforementioned experiment and that therapy with the help of dolphins cannot be considered a legal treatment with more therapeutic ability than temporary mood improvement. Due to the small effects of treatment, the high costs of this method, and the dolphins being put under pressure to play and move patients in the water, some researchers believe that treatment with the help of dolphins is only a lose-lose game for the animal and the patient. A number of military organizations use dolphins for various purposes, including finding miners and rescuing them or buried and trapped humans. Many armies of the world have also used dolphins for various purposes, including saving the lives of missing or endangered people and discovering sea mines. During the Vietnam War, reports of the U.S. military using trained dolphins to kill Vietnamese divers caused controversy. The U.S. Navy at the time denied any training of dolphins for combat. However, today these animals are trained for various purposes by the U.S. military. The Soviet military is believed to have shut down its marine mammal training program in the 1990s. In 2000, news agencies reported the sale of dolphins trained to kill belonging to the Soviet Union to Iran. Finally, we must mention that all the creatures of nature are created by God and we must always take care of nature, thank you for being with us.